Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Daddy Easy here. This is just a fast video showing you guys the new Music Villa in V3. This is a um, microphone basically that's um, they basically try to imitate, well, not imitate, emulate the SM7B. I do have videos that I am working on that I actually already recorded, and I'm actually working on the editing and stuff like that of why you shouldn't buy the SM7B. There's other microphones out there that you can buy that's just as better i even showed a clone of the sm7b that looks just like it um now this one right here is the mv3 by music vela this is supposed to simulate an sm7b this has two um dbs more of game that if i'm remembering it correctly of what he told me um it does have everything correctly so i do want to state that um somebody else that made a video they basically said that they switches in the back did not work and i actually told them that the switches does work and this was defective mine's work i only paid the 175 dollars for this and the thing is um what shipping was 15 dollars um got here very very quick so can't go wrong with that um yeah this is basically how it sounds it does have the bass on here um if i actually turn the switch off uh, basically give me more settle but this is what I was looking for into a microphone like I said I do have a video that I'm working on well two videos I'm working on basically telling you why you shouldn't buy the SM7B and there is a, uh, a SM7B clone out there that looks just like it that has the um, XLY, the XLR um, port on the top part on the yoke um, so yeah I did make that video but this is what it sounds like um, the switches on the back does work See the switches right there. You can see it basically right there. What I do like about this mic is that, um, as you can see, I am using a mic booster. Um, with this mic, you don't need the mic booster. Um, the mic is, it's quiet. You don't really get background noise. Um, one thing that I did find funny when I had this on my Gold XLR Mini is that it works on condenser and it also works on um dynamic so um i need to call them and ask them um why is it you know still getting the phantom power on it even if i push it through it because normally with my zoom zdm1 um i can only put it in dy um, dynamic and it does not work with um uh, uh condenser on um, with phantom power so that's another thing i gotta look at i am messing with the settings and stuff like that but I do like the fact that I do have this CT1 booster on it just to give myself, you know, more gain and have my mic at a lower settings. That's what I basically like because I want to eliminate a lot of the noise in the background. So that's the only reason why I'm using a mic booster. But um, this is how it sounds and stuff like that. Um, um, I just want to show you guys exactly what it looks like. So right now, this is not a review. This is not a review for this um microphone. Normally I wouldn't even talk into the microphone like this with the um mic face in my mouth like that. I normally like to keep basically keep it like that and kind of like something like that right there. That's more of how I like to have my microphones when I'm doing stuff. But one thing I do want to show you guys, um, because the person also talking about oh, it's easy to take the um windscreen off on it is not um basically you have to get your nail inside as you can see i can't pull this off i gotta get my nail inside now i can pull it off and as you can see you can see the capsule on it like that you can see the mesh and stuff right there um this is basically what it looks like. Use the SM7B on uh, one screen like that. You can pop it in there. I'm gonna actually get some um, colored ones uh, from what is it? Color Wave, whatever. I forgot the name of the uh, website. And I'm gonna get this colored. So I am gonna change the body on this like that. But this is not a review. And basically, once you get this on it, you gotta snap it into place. And boom, it's locked in there and it's not coming out. Like I can literally turn it down and it's not going to fall off. Um, it's so big that you have to get the SM7B's um, pop filter, the um, the thick, thick ones like y'all seen on my ZDM1. Um, it does 
pop off and they take off a lot of the Pelosis on here. But I'm not going to do the video today for the review. This is just giving you guys an update on um, this microphone that you guys see exactly how it looks. And I'm going to catch you guys later. Stay tuned for that video soon. And I'm going to catch you guys later. That's it. And I'm out. Deuces. And I'm out of here.